are you um, are you enrolled in, in any sort of educational institution anywhere in the state of North Carolina? No, ma'am. Okay. Fighting back tears, Connor Terrell made his first court appearance after allegedly posting a threatening video to Snapchat on Friday. In the video, you can see a dark colored handgun and someone's finger on it. By Saturday night, investigators took the 23 year old from Mebbin into custody. And in the video, a man stated, um, and she's my language, I'm just going to quote it. That's okay. I'm going to shoot up school Monday, save on high school, North Carolina. Go down, kind of go down at three, and the video cuts off right there. Today, we saw two squad cars and officers patrolling on foot outside East Wake Academy in Zebulon. So we take every threat very seriously. The school is home to 1,200 students across five buildings. This is our K-4 building. Executive Director Tom Miller showing us the locks they use to fortify every classroom. It turns out and it locks in so kids know what to do as part of our you know a crisis plan it's all part of the training for students and staff that they luckily did not need this time i was very impressed at the lack of information that i thought that they had to what they were able to execute in 24 hours that was very you know impressive to me WREL investigates searched through five years of records showing just 11 people were charged statewide last year for communicating threats to a school 13 charges in the 2018 19 fiscal year and 100 charges in North Carolina the year before the same year as the Parkland Florida and Santa Fe school shootings what goes on in this country fortunately too often uh, the state takes this very seriously 